And then he told me that it was actually fake. <laughs> oh, hey, today's her birthday. It, it's okay, Percy. Just let them do their thing. Chiron let us eat in here so that we could be together. He said it was his gift to Annabeth. Well, speaking of gifts... Oh, yeah, one sec. For you. Thank you. So we can match. Percy. <laughs> Thank you so much. I know this sweater doesn't look like much, but coming from Percy, it's basically the best gift I could have gotten. See, last winter, Sally was like getting on to him because he never dresses up for anything. I mean, he wore a t-shirt and jeans to his college interview, but for Christmas, I got him this blue sweater and he was so reluctant to even try it on. But when he finally did, he decided he actually liked how he looked in it. So the fact that he got me this just so that we can wear our blue sweaters together is just so... I really love him. Today is the day. <laughs> Explain. Oh, yeah, so my birthday was a couple days ago, right? And that day I came up with the best idea of how to celebrate ever. The Lee Olympics. Trademark pending. But, you know, we needed a couple days to get ready, so now it's a couple days later, and today is the day. May the odds be ever in your face. <laughs> Leo, that is not, it is not that serious. I've been helping Leo prepare for about a week now. I've spent all my time writing out cards for two of the games, the trivia one and the do what I'm saying in Spanish game. Leo spent nearly all his time on the real life version of that VR game, Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes, but then a little birdie uh, told Chiron about that idea and it got nixed. So the new third game is named that tool. Oh, yes. So I believe my conversation with Leo went something like this. Leo, what are you planning for your birthday? Well, I want it to be a surprise. It could be a surprise for everyone else, but not for me. Oh, so I'm building these little bombs. Stop. No, you're not. But they're just tiny ones. Leo, those still kill people. 